hello friends welcome back to my channel today i'm going to explain to you how to bridge uh how to bridge or send crypto from one network to another network on the same uh on the same wallet let me say it like that let me give you an example of what i'm talking about now this is my bitget wallet this is bitget wallet as in bits get bits get wallet not just the bit get app this is the bit get wallet and this wallet contains a lot of networks like you can have bitcoin ethereum ton blah 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 many of them so we're going to be using this one as an example this one which is called uh bmb chain we're going to be using it as an example due to an airdrop i'm going to use that airdrop to make an explanation about this bridging so it is actually called bridge what i want to uh, teach you today it is bridge so for example now you have bmb network here you can see this is a bmb network here so this is bnb now this bmb there's a wallet here this wallet uh is also the same bmb many of these things are if they are under bmb network for example, this airdrop is match chain. In this airdrop, if you go into this place, you are going to have BNB also. This BNB also have the same wallet. So if you send BNB to this address, it's, it will mostly or likely or most especially appear in this BNB wallet that we have here. So now I'm going to send $1 of BNB to this address or let me see i probably have one dollar of bnb currently in this address now let us look at this match chain also this is the match chain wallet and i do not have any bnb in this match chain So if you come down to my group you are going to see that i posted the contract address and i'm also going to leave it in the description of this video so you can send uh, your bnb from anywhere into this bnb wallet now let us make an example i'm going to be sending bnb from my uh you can see this is bnb i'll send it from my trust wallet now to this address so this is my trust wallet now let's go to bnb now let's save bnb to the address so let's say we are sending one dollar worth of bnb into the address so now the bnb is sending so how did i get to have this uh match chain airdrop in my bitget so i have to connect my wallet in the match chain airdrop so just now the bnb i sent has already uh being received by this wallet now let us refresh can you see that it is not here it is not on this bnb now let us check the other bnb can you see now the one dollar is already here so the one dollar actually came in here so now i have to find a way to bring that one dollar bnb from this part up to this part here can you see that so this is what we are learning today and this is called bridge do you understand we want to bridge we want to send that bnb into this bnb part here so now we are going to follow the airdrop procedure now let's go into the airdrop now this is the match airdrop do you understand that this is a matching airdrop matching airdrop so look at the airdrop look at what it's saying so those are the procedure that the airdrop gives now let us follow it now this is the bitget wallet you remember i just showed you my bitget wallet so i connected my wallet using this part here i connected my wallet do you understand that so now let's go into it now so i've already done the uh bit get with a uh, match chain so these are the tags you need bit get wallet search and add your match chain which you are going to use your contract address to add so let me quickly show you how to do that so after you copy the address um, which is the contract address from my telegram group or from my whatsapp group or from the description of this video you are going to come to this part here 
then you are going to search down here after you have connected your wallet to the airdrop you're going to see this thing here matching matching so after clicking on that uh, matching you're going to have this part here you see that the network is already on match chain and the next thing you need to do is to come to this search part here once you click on it paste the contract address after pasting it there it will bring out this lol airdrop there you're going to add it make sure you remember to add you add it to this part it will show that it has not listed but just add it can you see that not listed let me quickly do a practical example so now i have copied it so now you can paste it here just paste it here after pasting it there then you can now add token have you seen it so after add can you see that i've added can you see it showing minus if i click it now it will show that uh, i should remove it so then you have to just make sure your own is added can you see that added to so once it is added, you'll find it here just like this. Have you seen it like that? So now back to the lecture for today. What we want to do is bridge. So now we have to send that from BNB to this match chain. So let it show in this part here. So have you connected your wallet? Connect BitGets. Make sure you claim your reward for connecting the wallet. After that, you have to join their telegram. Make sure you do that. Now, bridge a minimum of. So, make sure you do that. Join their Telegram. Claim the reward. Now, you have to bridge a minimum of $1 equivalent in BNB from BSC to Mat Chain Network. Though that Mat Chain is a network itself. So, that is the only tax that is remaining. And that is the main reason for this video. So, now let's go into it. So now can you see that it has opened the BitGet app? So if yours did not open the BitGet app, you can easily copy the link of the uh, airdrop. Let me just do that straight so that it will be easier for anyone in case of future and it's not only this airdrop, maybe now another airdrop. So if you come from this party, once you open your matching um, airdrop, then you go to claim then to show something like this okay you try to claim it then it is telling you insufficient gas fee and all that it's telling you to go to bridge because it's understand that probably you have already put the gas fee but you have not been able to bridge it to the main network so then you are going to click on go to bridge then after going to bridge then i'm going to uh, make it to show in my chrome browser so this is in my chrome browser the next thing i'm going to do is to copy this uh these things here you can see you can see so this is the bridge part here so you have to copy it so it says something is wrong i think that's just network issue let's refresh it so you can see that connects and all that and blah 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 so you just come to this part here copy the uh whatever here then go to your bit get so i'm telling you in case of future purpose so this is a website where you can easily uh bridge uh through different network now come to your bit get and then go to this part here this browser part here then paste the link of the bridge whatever then after pasting it then open it then get into the website and the next thing is going to say is for you to connect the wallet don't forget i copied the link from the chrome browser or from anywhere you are using it then you paste it in the bitget app or in case of future any other app that you are using any crypto app then go to connect then choose the bitget it's now loading it's going to connect the bitget now connected the next thing we need to do is to choose bmb bmb don't forget the bmb is on bmb chain so we want to transfer it from that bmb and send it from bnb chain to bnb match chain you understand so from bnb we have some amount of bnb there more than one dollar worth of bnb then we're going to choose where it is going to so just come to this part here you can see that now choose this um arrow that you are seeing down here so choose this this thing so once you choose it then scroll down then you can see the match match uh quest or match matching then click it make sure you choose um bmb you can see it down there can you see it 
if it's not loading on time wait for it to load then choose it now can you see that we're now exchanging from bmb on bsc to bmb on match chain can you see that now so then you click on this um max it don't forget you need one dollar watts so i just sent one dollar watts also if you want to buy you can easily contact me to buy you can get my contact through the description then you can buy anyone that you need to buy or any cryptocurrency or anything so the next thing you now need to do is to copy from here sorry max it from here or any amount you are sending anyhow so now can you see now it is now coming from here to from bsc to match chain then we're going to so now what we have seen it now so this is what we are exchanging so this is the uh, bnb on mass chain they are going to click on this continue path down here you can see the continue then after clicking on it it's going to ask us some things you can see what we have here now uh, bnb to mass chain then we'll click on transfer after clicking on transfer it is loading now let's wait for it to fully load now it is asking for signature which is showing that you approve this transfer or exchange from one network to the other so now let's wait for it and let's see what is going to happen so it's showing something here and something here so just now say swap bnb for blah 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 everything mm -hmm. like that so i believe this is already said okay we can see it up here we can see 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 that so now let's go check it So now the BNB has already left the BNB chain. You can see from here, it has already left this chain part here. Now let's check the matching, uh, the match chain. So let's refresh the match chain. So now this is the BNB displaying on the match chain now so the bnb has already moved from the bnb network and now you can see the match chain now as the bnb in it so this is called bridging so i've just bridged the bnb from the bnb chain to the mass chain network so all these things you have here is network so we just move the bnb from this part here to this part here so that is bridging so just now i've already explained bridging in this video so do not forget the website which i entered into i also drop it in the description below so this is the website here so don't forget that you enter into the website after we're entering the website they are going to go to connect wallet after connecting the wallet they are going to choose the network and the network here then when you know that the thing is working perfectly it's going to show a countdown in this part here a countdown that is showing the bridging time and everything just like i explained in the video so now i'll go back to the mini app on the uh on the telegram and let's see so back to telegram then click on claim so it's already claiming now it's loading as you can see so now just click on the claim again on the the claim from the telegram mini app just like i explained in this video then uh confirm it then i'm going to put my passcode then let's see so now i'm claiming i'm claiming the law lol drop so it's fail it just still fail just now so let me try again You can see that my wallet is connected on this part it's connected to bitget you can see that the bit it's now showing the amount of bnb i have on the match chain so i'm doing the other tax now this tax i've just completed the tax by doing the bridge of a minimum of one dollar equivalent in bnb to bsc mass chain do you understand that network the one i just explained now so i'm going to claim the reward so that is done mm -hmm. now 
So this scene has been loading for a while now. So can you see it has already shown claim? And if you now go into my BitGet wallet, you have seen it here. So I have claimed hundred thousand of this LOL airdrop, and you can see here that it is not yet listed. When it is listed, we are going to know the price that it is worth. So this is the full video on the explanation of the bridging parts of cryptocurrency under the same uh, wallet. I mean network changing this network from uh, this bmb chain to uh match chain you can just see that now i've just explained everything about that now so i believe that you'll be able to do your own also if you don't understand the video make sure you watch the video over and over again because i explained step by step on how i am doing mine and i just did this now completely in this video so thanks for watching make sure you uh, subscribe to my channel make sure you like and comment any question you have about this explanation or any other video you want me to make about cryptocurrency